first at four from the Target 12 investigators, a new state police report shows inappropriate contact a Providence Middle School teacher allegedly had with his former student may have gone on for years. Thank you for joining us. I'm Kim Kalunian. And I'm Kayla Fish. We first told you at this time yesterday about that teacher's court appearance. Target 12 investigator Alexandra Leslie joins us now live in studio with what she learned about the case today. Alex. Well, the victim told police the alleged abuse started when she was 15 years old and the encounters happened as frequently as twice per week until she was 18. An incident report obtained by Target 12 shows a Providence Middle School teacher may have been sexually assaulting a former student for years. The victim, now an adult, filed an incident report with Providence Police last Thursday. Target 12 obtained the report, which says the victim told police that Joseph Gannon, her former middle school teacher, began contacting her by email and on social media when she was 15. State records show Gannon is a science teacher at Nathaniel Green Middle School. He was arrested and charged with first-degree sexual assault and producing child pornography. The victim told police Gannon invited her to his house in August 2019. The report stated that Gannon would take her to different public areas like parks, hotels, and behind buildings, in addition to a hotel in Massachusetts. Portions of the report explaining what the victim detailed to police were redacted, but police said Gannon would tell her not to go to the hospital or to tell her friends what happened. The victim says she met repeatedly with Gannon until she was 18 years old. She also told police that Gannon took photos and videos of their time together. A judge ordered Gannon held without bail yesterday and issued a no contact order between him and the victim. No plea was entered in court. He's due back on September 30th for a bail hearing. Live in studio with the Target 12 investigators, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News. Begin at five with new details from the Target 12 investigators as alleged sexual abuse between a Providence middle school teacher and his former student may have gone on for years. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kim Kalunian. I'm Mike Montecalvo. Joseph Gannon faced a judge yesterday and was ordered held held without bail. Target 12 investigator Alexandra Leslie obtained a report from Providence Police. She joins us now live in studio with the new details. Well, the victim told police that she and Joseph Gannon started meeting up outside of school when she was 15, being invited to his home and to a hotel across state lines. According to an incident report obtained by Target 12, a female victim told Providence Police that Joseph Gannon, her former middle school teacher, began contacting her by email and on social media when she was 15, and the alleged sexual abuse happened as frequently as twice per week until she was 18. She told police anytime she would meet with Gannon, he would give her gifts that were sexual in nature, and encounters would happen in public parks, hotels, and behind buildings. She said Gannon also allegedly pressured her not to go to the hospital or to tell her friends about the encounters. She said he took pictures and videos of them engaging in sexual acts together or of just her alone. Gannon was arrested at Nathaniel Green Middle School, where he's employed as a science teacher last Friday. He was charged with first degree sexual assault and producing child pornography. Gannon was placed on leave, though the Providence Public School District wouldn't clarify if that was paid or unpaid. And Gannon didn't enter a plea in court for either charge. A judge issued a no contact order between him and the victim. He's due back in court for a bail hearing on September 30th. Live in the studio with the Target 12 investigators, Alexandra Leslie, 12 News.